Okay, the installation is done. As you can see, if I scroll up here, you see several warnings and it's also redirecting to another FTP server when it's trying to download something and this is the warnings I get and stuff like that. So it doesn't matter as long as it's completed as succeeded. So uh, you're good to go. So what we did is we just installed virtual min. So let's get on to the login page and start hosting some websites. But before we do that, we have to configure some settings within the virtual min. So I'm going to uh, minimize this. I'm going to let's go back to oops, sorry, I clicked on that. Let's go back to the virtual min side and view some docs. Here, if you want to learn in depth about using virtual virtual min and all the advanced features, which I'm not going to cover on this video because it's just um, too much. So just um, go to installation, getting started. I think I remember just go back to your um, power panels um, IP address or your VPS IP address and just use uh, port 10,000 okay so HTTP as your IP and port 10,000 and you will get this warning just um, click I understand the risk it's just a um, um, SSL security warning saying that the the SSL does match the name for the SSL because it's using the IP address so it doesn't really matter just click add exception get certificate here and confirm security exception you will see the login page right so we're ready to go now just click here to remember the login and when I log in root and my password uh, let's grab that again always store it in my email account here I'm gonna grab this and always remember to exclude the white space behind it okay copy without the white space copy it like this and then go back here and enter it login and just remember the password so here we are inside the virtual min um, web control panel let's go the together with the post installation wizard I'm gonna click next here um, let's discuss this one by one memory use um, preload virtual min libraries I want um, yes run email domain lookup server I don't want slower I always want faster okay just faster next and you will be using this virtual server for yourself anyways right so just use the faster options all the time use faster mail processing next it takes a while to save the climb AV scanner configuration spam assassin faster I want faster more RAM just 30 meg megabytes is fine we don't we don't need postgre SQL so click now on this one okay next okay my my SQL root password I'm gonna use the same root password that I'm gonna click next now as you can see virtual min post installation configuration is now complete okay so now click next 
virtual main configuration has not been checked since it was last updated so just recheck and refresh configuration so it's missing something okay it's missing what they called mailman so this is for running uh, mailing list mailing list software so let's go ahead and install this mailman together we're gonna go back to putty here and um, let's install mailman so let's try using yum install mailman let's see if we can get that okay there's no packages I suppose we have to install it manually okay so let's do that so as you can see there's always gonna be uh, some troubleshooting uh, when you're installing um, stuff in your VPS so it's a common practice so let's search for install mailman here we go and what about this one 